Alright, here we go. See how it's clear? Now the more you roll that in, the clearer it'll get. Now, this is what I'm worried about, this edge. It's kind of sharper than I thought it was going to be. But if I can get it to lay in there, the problem is, is when I go rolling that way, it's going to pull it out. So I might have to just roll it in. Like I said, that's what's cool about it having this tub you can just pour it in there and just start working it and it's going to soak up and you can just roll it all the way across and then go up the roller. See, this is where I was talking about. Ruining scissors. Because it doesn't. Because it's coming up that. Where they, it starts rolling back this way. It's starting to create wrinkles. And it doesn't want to stay up there. Plus, it doesn't have fiberglass on it yet. Or resin to help stick.
Now you see people on YouTube, there's where they're cracked and pulling it apart. So that will have to be repaired from the outside when I put them together. But you'll see people on YouTube, you know, they wear gloves when they do this. I started off wearing gloves, but it got to the point to where the gloves, they would stick to the fiberglass when you had to move it. So it was more pain in the butt. Um, trying to move stuff, move fiberglass around with the rubber gloves on because it would the resin would actually stick to the gloves and it got to the point and you'd say I have a short temper when it comes to some of this stuff and uh, so I just quit wearing the gloves I'll take acetone and clean my fingers and, and, you know I'm a crease monkey mechanic so most